you may have heard the Antifa activist that was uh, suspected in the shooting death of a Trump supporter in Portland last weekend uh, was killed by law enforcement tonight. There he is. That's Michael Forrest Reinhold from a video that uh, he did with Vice. Dot com. He was giving interviews. He was uh, actually claiming self-defense that the Trump supporter had tried to kill him. But, uh, yeah, cops ended up getting him. 100% Antifa, 100% dead. Yeah, the Antifa activist uh, by the name, again, Michael Forrest Reinhold was uh, killed Uh, Looks like it happened in uh, Lacey, Washington. New York Times were the first ones to actually report this. Uh, They were attempting to arrest him. What was interesting was that Fox News, the story is that Fox News had contacted law enforcement in Portland uh, because supposedly they were looking for the guy. They knew who he was and said, hey, have you seen this video of this guy? He's uh, he's doing interviews. Um, What I will say is that I felt that my life and other people around me's lives were in danger. And I felt like I had no choice but to do what I did. What you did was shoot an unarmed man, you son of a bitch. I think it's interesting here that it were it was federal agents that got him and uh, not Portland law enforcement. Anyway, uh, the Associated Press is reporting that uh, a, a senior Justice Department official saying that uh, Mr. Reinhold was shot by law enforcement when he pulled a gun during an arrest attempt by FBI and U.S. Marshals. Uh, let's see, says here, Mr. Reinhold had admitted earlier Thursday to having killed Aaron Danielson, saying he had no choice. He was uh, defending a, quote, friend of color. He claimed that uh, Mr. Danielson had pulled a knife on him, but there doesn't appear to be any proof of that. Danielson was a member of the uh, Patriot Prayer uh, group. They were conducting a car caravan through Portland on Saturday, all in support of of Donald Trump, and it's a damn shame that uh, Mr. Danielson lost his life, but uh, Reinhold also, and by the way, yes, the 100% Antifa thing is something he always called himself, and he was always, he apparently was at all of these demonstrations and riots. He'd been arrested multiple times. He was all over social media saying that uh, that he was a part of the, that this whole Portland Antifa thing, it's a war, and there will be casualties. He was making promises that he was going to kill somebody, And eventually he did. Of course, law enforcement in Portland, they didn't do a damn thing. Uh, They're following orders, you know, from the mayor, Ted Wheeler there. Uh, He gave an interview, like I said, to uh, to Vice News, and he said he wanted to get his story out. And then he decided to put up a fight, and the cops shot him. Now, you got to wonder what's going to happen. Will there be riots in Portland over Reinhold's death? Probably. Anyway, we have the video. Here it is. The very first video that came out was actually um, a person that was a resident in the neighborhood where the shootout took place. Let's take a look at that right now. Damn. They were not playing. Fuck. I think he did. Yeah, I think he dead for real. <laughs> I was sitting in my backyard and all I heard was pop, 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 pop. I'm like, oh shit. Come outside. There's a million sheriff out here. And this dude laying down here by the mailbox. He bleeding. He, they hit him. Damn. That's crazy, yo. Biggie. 
I thought it was fireworks at first. I was like, man, somebody letting off. Oh, there was a pop, 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 pop. Anybody would want to shoot out with the police out here. They deep. Yeah, you see all those yellow markings? Those are bullets. <laughs> they let loose on them. They didn't catch him. They shot him. Yeah, he he laying there on the ground right there. So there you have it. The guy that considered himself to be 100% Antifa is 100% dead. <laughs> and I call that a taxpayer relief shot. I'm Jazz McKay. God bless America. God bless our law enforcement and death to the new world order. Well, thanks for watching, and be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, share to your social media, and leave nasty comments below. Also, follow me on Twitch, where I do a podcast Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. That's www.twitch.tv slash The Jazz McKay Show.